perfect start from the front row, uh, but a brilliant start for Brad Jones. He gets off the line really quick and dives underneath his teammate at the top, and Tegro Yamaha, and then grabs an early lead from Alistair Seeley. Uh, Seeley, however, noses back underneath as they go down into the left hand of Brooklyn at the end of the Wellington Strait. And then it's all to play for. Jack Kennedy comes through beneath his teammate, but this time the slightly slower pace allows the GP2 bikes to get in the mix. And uh, they're chopping, changing at the front, the front three as they were yesterday. But this time, look at the bikes with the red numbers. Here comes Kyle Ryan, number 77, prodding his Ryan Sackovich tuned Kalex into second place. The battle amongst those three Yamahas at the front continues unabated and uh, Jack Kennedy decides he's got to make a move back past Kai Rai to keep an eye on what Alistair Seeley is doing. But Seeley holds him on and holds that lead as Brad Jones retakes third place on the road. This is the signature move of Alistair Seeley as he keeps stroking that EHA racing Yamaha beneath Jack Kennedy going through Maddox. Uh, Kennedy seems to be able to do nothing about it. Look, it happens again and again. So no rhythm established for Kennedy, but on the final lap, he decides he's got to go left no matter how small the gap is. He squeezes his way through, uh, and a momentary lapse by Seeley gets himself on the curb, almost on the grass, but he survives. Kennedy, however, takes his second race win of the weekend.